Hello, welcome back. This is Kenji 1913 and we are Let's Playing Gabriel Knight. Blood of the Sacred. Blood of the Damned. Gabriel Knight 3, by the way. Uh, anyways, in the last episode, uh, we made it to day 1, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. And unfortunately, uh, my game... Bike. Man, I need one of those. My game crashed. Who doesn't love when that happens? It literally crashed, right? Here's what happened. I had to restart my PC due to the fact that I could not get the F out of it. So hopefully now we're able to actually go and uh, do our thing here. But I highly doubt it. We'll see. Hopefully uh, this won't destroy everything that I hold dear. Please don't freeze. Hey, thank you. Hey, how you doing? I want to rent a bike. Oui. Your passport, please. Uh, Monsieur Knight, you are not with the tour group? I do not see you on my list. Nope. I'm on my own. Ah, I am sorry, Monsieur, but most of my fleet is reserved for the tour group. What? I have one little bike left, monsieur, but she is nothing grand. I show you. Here she is. This piece of crap? Oh, come on. I was kind of hoping for this baby. Ooh, what is this? A WW2 army issue? Oui, but the tour group reservations were made first. It is this little bike, monsieur, or nothing. Well, who gets the Harley? Whoever chooses it first, monsieur. If none of the others want the large bike, you may have it. Oh, yeah, like that's gonna happen. Well, let me know what you decide. Well, Gabriel drove a bike in the other game, didn't he? So... Now we gotta return to the hotel lobby. Yeah, but, yeah, Gabriel uh, rode a bike in the other game, so... I'm sure he's well versed in the motorcycling aspects of everything. But yeah, now we gotta go talk to somebody and be like, Yo, can I have the bike pretty please? Can I pretty please have the bike? But uh, yeah, this game is very interesting. Like I, uh, let's go in. We should be able to find somebody. But yeah, what, what, here's something. The tour group, why is everybody getting a moped? Don't you think they would travel on, like, a bike or something? Or, like, am I supposed to talk to you two? Maybe, I don't know. I noticed y'all moving suitcases around upstairs. Was there a problem with your room? Oh, my, yes. But that wasn't why we moved, Lily. No. Mr. Barza kindly offered to exchange with us. He's a Muslim, you see. Wanting to be facing east and all that. Mm. Well, Estelle and I are very much in favor of supporting the cultural differences between us, aren't we, darling? Yes, Lily. And it's a much nicer room. It's larger and has a balcony. Of course, I do appreciate the sacrifice. But then there are two of us, and only one of Mr. Barza. And I'm sure he's used to stuffier quarters. Middle Easterners so often are, you see. Yeah, I've, uh, heard that. Yeah. What's this here? Anything else I got to talk to him They're about? busy map gazing. Oh, that's what that is. It's a map. They're busy map gazing. Okay. Talk to Stella and Lily. Amelia wants to change them. Get rid of... Get the candy from the table. That, that's... Is there candy over here? Don't feel like sitting down. I don't know what... They say get candy from the table. What the hell is this? Oui, Monsieur Knight. I could, but maybe I should wait until Jean's elsewhere. Oh, this is candy. It's a black magic marker. Oh. Is this candy? Hmm. 
Oh, mint. Very nice. I wouldn't want to get greedy about it. I guess not. All right, now let's come over and take the pen. I guess we're going to need that, too. What is this? You never know when you might need a black magic marker. Alright, so... <coughs> walk up the steps... To the second floor. And look around... Look for the painting of the road opposite room 27. There's room 27 there. This is a picture of the road. Let's look at it. They need to get some of my dad's paintings in here. These are a bit too happy for my taste. Put the candy on the table. Walk down the steps and return to the lobby. What the hell am I making? Like an offering to Emilio or something? Um. Oh, right. So in order to get the, the stuff, I gotta get this candy. All right. Now that we've selected the candy, maybe we're setting like a bear trap? I don't know. And we turn to the lobby. Let's uh, go to the lobby. Come on. God damn it. All right. Pre Press 33 on the panel near the reception desk. Oh, over here? I'm guessing we're hitting 33. Moses down quickly walk up the steps all right so we gotta go up here how would you need how would you know to do this all right Sounds like he's going the other way. Am I supposed to go in the room? Ooh, I don't want to see Mosley's briefs. Stop to eat the candy. You're supposed to get the passport from his pocket. So we gotta try this again. Wow, what a weird, what a weird little puzzle, man. What a weird puzzle. I could, but maybe I should wait until Jean's elsewhere. Yeah, how would you even know to do this? Like, you know Mosley likes candy, but... Oh, here he is. Am I supposed to harass him? Get back over here, Gabriel. Alright, let, let the guy walk by. Yeah, weird. Alright, let's hit the 33 button again. <laughs> I think Mosley's got enough of a buzz going. Yeah, but how am I supposed to get his passport? Well, I figured if I sneak into his room... The candy's gone. I gotta go get it again. I gotta go get more candy. Because that mostly, he's got a sweet tooth.
At least, you know, this is one of them trial and error, 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 blah, 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 trial and error puzzles. Alright, now we hit the button. And now we go up the stairs and wait for mostly. the candy over here quickly 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 he'd see me god. he'd see me god damn it mostly if i could get him to stop somewhere for a minute i might be able to well to do some yeah well guess what i screwed up again because i stink honestly i've only played this game once man I've seen my older sister play it a bunch, but I've never actually played the whole way through. Oh, great. The game froze. All right. I am back. Yeah, the game froze. And I pretty much picked up the pen. And uh, we're going to head upstairs. And I'm going to grab me the candy. I just want to grab it. I just want to grab it. So we're going to put the candy over here. Right? So then mostly, when we ring him, if you remember, his room number is 33. And uh, we got to hit that button. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a save. Honestly, it looks like I'm going to have to do one of them... Uh, Save early, save often things. Night. 3D save. Alright, so now I gotta hit the button. Now, mostly is gonna come around, or mostly. We only have a certain amount of time. Where are you going, Gabriel? We only have a certain amount of time before he comes downstairs. So what I want to do is walk over here. And we'll hear him going downstairs. And we'll follow him creepily, by the way. Ooh, candy. So let's go. If I could get him to stop somewhere for right. a minute, I right. might be able to, well, so here we go. Let's try and grab Mosley's uh, passport. Because, yeah, this is the most logical thing, honestly. Honestly, you know what would have been better? Is if you had... Look at him. Look at the slob. How does he not know Gabriel's there? Come on. How does he not know Gabriel's there? Come on, game. Like, no offense... Like, this game's not bad, but seriously? Seriously? That's how you're gonna steal? Alright, so now we gotta go into our inventory. And combine the black marker. With this. That's better. Alright, so you get the passport, combine the black one, draw a mustache, open the door to 33, get the gold blazer. So now I gotta go back into his room. Let's take his jacket. See, this is where his passport should have been. What else do I gotta take? Look at that. They finally make a joke about how the everything fits in his pocket. That's good. I actually like that. That's funny. All right, let's get the hell out of here. I better get out of here before Mount Everest returns. All 
right, so now we just did some... You know, because honestly, Gabriel... Like, it would have been better for him to just go in the hotel. Or go in, into his room while he's not there. And then go outside or whatever. Alright, so now we gotta go to the museum. Which I believe is over here. Yeah, and you can't hit the escape button and go th I think this is the... No, this is the church. What the hell is the museum? Is it further down or something? I don't remember where the hell the museum is. Hey, there's a kitty. Oh, that's good to know. Alright, let's go back. Yeah, this is a pain in the ass. This is a church. Um, okay, yeah, this is the museum. Yeah, I don't know how you would know to do this, by the way. And yeah, I'm just gonna hit escape, because it takes a while to get to everywhere. So now there's a cat, which we gotta do something. Oh, I bet you we gotta take some cat hair. How ridiculous is this, seriously? Like, some of this stuff is just crazy. Anyways, I'm just gonna save it a lot. Alright, so, let's see. Mm, you can't pet the cat, and you'll run. he'll run into the hole, but you should... Have uh, half turn left. The cat will run through the hole in the door, exit the alley, then return to the alley. See the cat's on the wall. Let's go pet the kitty. You try to share a little human kindness, and what does it get you? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I gotta go back a little bit. Where the hell's the cemetery? Apparently there's a green path or something. Oh, over here. Alright, now we're in the cemetery. There's supposedly Maxine Lafayette, Louis Hofis. There's a spray bottle or something around there. Look, there's a guy with the church. Let's take it. It's far where he goes. All right. So how are you supposed to know to do all this? I don't know. I've never done this. The only reason why I would spray a cat with a water bottle is because, you know, they're being bad, but... I would never ever think about doing this. This is just an odd. This is like one of them. They call them moon, moon logic puzzles or something. I don't know. Shit, man, go. All right, as you can see now, the cat is on the wall. Grassroom church. Sorry. Uh, half turn left, follow the path the other way, cat on the alley. Pet the cat and it will run through the hole. Exit the alley and return to the alley again. Using the masking tape 
Put the hole on the door. Then spray the cat on the wall. It will leave you fur. Really? It's weird. Alright, so let's take uh, the masking tape. And put it over here. I guess, uh... You can hmm, have... That's a tight squeeze, but the cat hasn't left any fur behind on those boards. He might, though, with a little help. So I guess if you use the, uh... I guess if you use the, uh, the idea button, it'll actually do something. I don't know why he would do this. Why doesn't Gabriel just steal, like, his picture? Or, like, fiddle around with it and have mostly. But now he put, now he's gotta, he's gotta use the thing and all this craziness. Alright. Now, I gotta use the spray bottle. On the kitty? I guess so. What's I our... kind of like that squeezing through the hole bit. I wonder if I could get him to do it again. Now, if you try to pet him, I don't think you can reach him. Ah, I can't get up there. But if you spray him with the water bottle, he'll come down. Which, like, I only do when the cats get up on the table. Speaking of which, I think... That's mean. I guess it needs to be done. Now I got... Now not only did you screw the cat's day, but you you got to take the tape, too. It worked! Jesus. Alright, um... This is too funny. Alright, so now... We have to combine the fur with the syrup. How the hell would you think to know this shit? Combine the fur with the syrup. And now you have a mustache. Use the black mustache on the gold blazer. And now you have your mustache. Use the cap on there. Now that's a Mosley outfit. Wow. All right, well, now we have a Mosley outfit. If anybody sees me in this thing, I'll have to leave town immediately. All right, so there you go. All right, so one thing I'm going to do again is save, because apparently the game likes to crash a bit. All right, let's head up this way. Back through the, the alleyway. Or wherever the church or whatever the hell it was. Yeah, th you know, I'm not going to lie. This game isn't bad, but... It just, I don't know, it's just weird. Go away. There you go. Right, here we are back over here. Where am I? Oh man, suddenly I gotta take a leak. Alright, so let's use... Yeah, and you, you can see... Oh my god. Alright. Gabriel, where are you? No peeking. Where are you? Yeah, oh yeah, you're definitely Mosley. Hi, is this where y'all rent mopeds? Oui, uh, may I see your passport? He doesn't even have... Ah, Monsieur Mosley. Yes, I have a reservation for you. One moment. He's got green eyes. You may have any bike in the lot, monsieur. This I can. Hey, 
I guess I'll take this big old hog here. How much is that? One hundred francs a day. Looks like we got us a deal. There you are, monsieur. You pay when you return the bike. Golly, thanks. But wait, the toll group gets my special treasure chest package. You get the binoculars and the shovel with that. Oh, great. Best of luck, monsieur. If you strike it rich, you will remember poor little Bigot, will you not? That's right. I will not. <laughs> Thank you so much. Whew, man. The things I'll do for a decent back. Oh, I better put this stuff back before Mosley has a conniption. Ah, at least you're, you're being nice. Alright, so let's save it again. You know, in the last game, you know, you'd have to wait till Mosley found out that you were doing that stuff. Alright, there we go. Um... So, return... Da, 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 da. You give him the Bacchus key, return to the bike shop, and use the green bike, and leave the village. So, it's now time to head on out. And so are Schottenegger roots into the French countryside. Yeah, and I hope the damn game doesn't crash anymore. I literally have to restart my computer because I can't alt shift uh I was about to say alt shift X. I can't control alt delete out of it. Alright, so we are Where are we? Uh is there anything on the map that gives me like locations? I don't get any of this. Where am I? Select the Chateau Blanchot on the map. I don't know. Nothing. There's no words. Oh, here we go. Thank you. Chateau Blanchot. Larry Chester's house. Yeah, we heard about him. Kazakhstan. And yeah, I always thought that this, these little dots here were actually people, but I don't think they are. Anyways, let's head to the Chateau Blanche Fort. Face the road and wait for Wilkes to drive by on his bike. When he does, click on him and select the following icons. And select the follow icon. So yeah, here we are at Chateau de la Rue or something. Rock Negra. Black Rock. And yeah, we gotta follow Wilkes to the Hermitage, I guess. Here he comes. Oh, we're... Oh, we were supposed to follow him. Let's try it again, I guess. We were supposed to follow him. How about we stand in the middle of the street? Now get out of the middle of the street, Gabriel. God. You're, you're looking for a death wish. Go through changes. Alright, we're gonna follow Wilkes and then that's it. Wilkes? Here we go. Here we go. Him. All right, we're the green dot, and he's the, the little parking lot. He's the orange dot. I don't know what the blue dot is. Le Hermitage. Le Hermitage. All right, so here we are at the Hermitage, and I'm actually gonna save the game. And in the next episode, we are going to head up there and see what's going on. So yeah, I'm going to stop the video here, and in the next episode, we will continue. I've been Kenshin 13 I'll see you later. Bye-bye.